Mary Jackson, and I am in the basement of Welshmer Library, and I want to show you some resources that we have. And they are in the movable shelving that we have down in the basement of the library. So sometimes, when you get to where you want to be, which for you all is going to be the very last set of shelves, you need to crank a little bit to get it big enough that you can use it. And then you can come down here and you can see all the bound periodicals that you can use. Also including the one that uh, Art Brown has mentioned, Communication Arts is right here. And we have several years of Communication Arts and you can refer to these. I will talk about some of the other periodicals um, in just a second. All right, we have many old periodicals, old magazines, um, and some of them go very, back very far. This is Vanity Fair, and it's from the teens, and so you can see some of the advertising and what it looks like and the types of fonts and styles that they have, which would be very useful for this assignment. We also have decades worth of Life magazine. It's a much bigger magazine, has lots of pictures and photos, and you can also see some examples of some very orange um, advertising. Uh, and you can see some things that uh, are different than how we do things now. Um, and so I hope you would, that might be another place that you could look for information. Here is a Time magazine from the 50s, but we also have many decades worth of time. And again, you can see a different style of how they've done advertising in here. And finally, this is Newsweek from the 80s. And you can see some of the examples. You'll see a few more companies that you might recognize here. So this is just a few of the periodicals that we have. And you can come into the basement of the library and use these. You can't take them out of the building, but you're welcome to photocopy or just look at them.